Hello, greetings everyone. Standing before you, this is your academic tutor. My name is Alison Jezuru. This video is for those people that are under my online tuitions and those of you that have been following me on all social media platforms. So in this short video, I want to give you major topics, topics that you are supposed to know before you enter an exam. So this is mathematics paper 2, this is it standard. So those of you that are from Zambia, this is for you, especially if you are my student. We are going to measure so much on these topics which are listed down here. So make sure that uh, you take note of this. Even as you are starting, make sure that you go through these topics that I'm going to share with you. So I'll start with uh, section A. Section A, the topics that you're supposed to know are matrices, sets, probability, quadratic equations, vectors, GP, calculus. Calculus comes with uh, menstruation sometimes. So you need to know how to find the volume of a first term. You need to know those uh, questions. And we also have computer operations where you are given a flow chart and you are told to put down a pseudocode or maybe you are given a pseudocode then you are told to draw a flow chart you need to know those uh, questions the last one is construction this one you need to know it carries eight marks so construction and quadratic equations just knowing these two you get 13 marks for free quadratic equations carries five marks construction eight marks so these ones you are supposed to know them so just like this, you are on your way to get a distinction. So even as you are studying, these topics that I've listed down are for section A, and you are supposed to know them. So you don't need to know everything. There is what I call AOC, area of concentration. You don't need to know everything for you to get a distinction. I've been doing these teachings for over four years now and I know what comes in an exam. So you knowing these topics, you are on your way to get a distinction. So even as you are studying, make sure that you study through these topics. Let us now go to section B. So paper two section B, you are taught to answer only four questions. So you will be taught to answer only four questions. And from these four questions, the first one, that you need to put into consideration is trigonometry. Trigonometry carries two of marks. You are supposed to know it. Trigonometry, statistics, and linear programming. So these three, you need to know them. The last but not the least, you need to know graphs of polynomial. So some of you don't know what graphs of polynomial is. So graphs of polynomial is where you are given a table of content then uh, you draw a curve, should be a quadratic curve or a cubic curve. So you need to know these things. So there are only four topics that you need to know from section B. And even as you are starting, I know some of you are saying there is a uh, geometry, sir. Those ones, I'm giving you questions that you are going to answer. I've told you that you don't need to know everything. AOC, area of concentration, should be linear programming, trigonometry, statistics, graphs of polynomial. These four, you are supposed to know them. Trust me, you get a distinction. So if you are under my online tuitions, make sure that you write down these topics that I've presented before you. Everything outside this, maybe you are studying for paper one, I will understand, but if you are studying for paper two, study these topics that I've given you. There is algebra, which is a general topic that every student must know. So algebra should be known. That's why I haven't included it on my list. This is one of the basics that you are supposed to know in mathematics. So thank you so much. And for those of you that would like to join my online tuitions, you call me, this is Zambia, so you call me on my number, which is 0971. 06 67 47
this is the right time for you to start online tuitions with us. Thank you so much.